Hey, Disney, how's it going? How you doing? You doing good? You good? You good? Do you need anything? No? Come here. Come closer. Come closer. Yeah. We need to talk. So for a lot of you guys who don't already know, Epcot is getting a brand new nighttime show titled Harmonious. And this new nighttime show involves the installation of quite a few uh, new fireworks barges, I guess you can say. Either fireworks barges, water fountain barges, and screens. There's a lot of stuff going on in World Showcase Lagoon right now. And um, while a few of the barges have already been put out and they have been criticized as looking like giant tacos <laughs> that are floating on the water, um, Disney just recently put out the newest barge, which is supposed to be the centerpiece of this entire nighttime show. And it has gotten quite a bit of criticism, I'm not gonna lie. And, you know, I'm personally not a big fan of how it looks, but... At the same time, though, I am going to be 100% fair to this situation. It is not complete. This show is still in the process of being constructed. It's still being put together. There's a lot that I'm sure still needs to be done. But just initially, you know, it just doesn't look quite good. And... You know, it's no secret that if you have been on the channel for a while that you'll know that Epcot used to be my all-time favorite park. I loved Epcot so much. Prior to its refurbishment and all the construction walls and everything, it used to be my favorite park. Now, it's not so much. I'm leaning more towards the Hollywood Studios side. But anyways, um, I was scrolling through Twitter today, and um, I saw this post from um, username Shmoofy, uh, Bredatui, and he didn't have anything really nice to say about this new new barge, and I had posted about it before, that the placement of this barge, if this is its permanent resting place, it is going to drive people with OCD up a wall. And I want to show you guys this because this is... Mm. So we're coming up over here, and uh, this is what Bredatui posted. I had to censor this, obviously. How the F does the same company who made the new Epcot Fountain, Runaway Railway, Galaxy's Edge, Cars Land, Mystic Manor, and more just screw around and approve this uncentered monstrosity? Anyone with their name on this should be ashamed. So this tweet right here is drawing up a lot of controversy. And just scrolling through the comments, you can see people are pretty pretty divided on this whole subject and you know there are people who are agreeing with him and then there are people who are uh, disagreeing with him and i love this um it, it was agatha all along it was always agatha and um this post right over here uh is getting a closer look at it this is what it's supposed to look like this is concept art and even then in this concept art over here you can see that it's a bit more centered on the american adventure pavilion and um it's supposed to, they're supposedly using this during the day as as well. They're going to be uh, using water screens and everything, and they're going to do little shows throughout the day, kind of similar to what World of Color does over at uh, Disney's California Adventure over in California. And so the post is, it may look good when it's complete though. Have you seen what they want the final product in the daytime to look like? And he says, notice how the fountains are actually just screens. And he says, the top fountains are real, the middle are just projected from the screens. And, you know, someone's saying that they never noticed that. So, um, yeah, if you look right over here, it looks to be like the giant tacos are just going to be projecting water, and then the very top of the taco, where all the stuffing is supposed to be, is going to be, you know, having the actual water effects come down. So, um... You know, it's just, it's, it's, this is, I, I really want to just get your opinions on this because this is drawing up a lot of different controversy. And, you know, there are people who are saying that, you know, this is a real big eyesore and you can see the memes already. The memes already are coming out. People are referring to this as a Stargate. So, um, I don't, I don't really know. Uh, and, and this was actually a really decent idea. I, I would actually prefer this more. Like, what if Disney added some some Mickey ears to it? That would make it look at least a little bit better, in my opinion. But at the same time, though, like, mm, it's still it, it's still looking a little weird. And I still overall don't quite know how I feel about this. Oh, I, again, in all fairness, I am waiting to... I'm reserving full judgment until we see the show. Like, I saw someone say in the comments, this show could be an absolute banger. 
and people won't even care in the slightest about what it looks like during the day. We don't know that, but just initial impressions right now, I'm seeing people on both sides saying, chill the F out, you know, this isn't done, and there are other people who are saying, yeah, this looks gross, what the heck is going on? I think it's just the fact that um, the initial picture that was posted, it's just, look, that is off-centered. I cannot even... Mm, it's bothering the hell out of me. And then I was posting on Twitter myself, if we come over here to Google Maps, we're going to be taking a look at this. And like, this is what I was talking about. Like, maybe they had a, a specific plan for this initially to be in line with, um, where the heck is Disney? Where in the world is Disney World? Oh, here we are. So maybe they had a plan for this. So this is a current look at World Showcase Lagoon. And you can see this is the very center over here. You can see RIP, all of that Spaceship Earth is right up there. We're coming down over here. And it's supposed to be, you know, you would expect that the new barge would be in line with this over here, the straightaway, which is, you know, the picture that we're referring to right here. You can see the center line right over here. And you would expect it to be in line with the American Adventure Pavilion, but no, it's kind of like off to the side over here somewhere rather than being right here. So I don't really know uh these this google maps is still showing the old school illuminations barges or maybe it's from the um older the other epcot show that they had going on epcot forever i'm not entirely sure but that's just what the controversy is right now surrounding this and i want to get your thoughts and opinions on this down in the comments section below again i'm reserving full judgment i mean currently initially my initial thoughts are this is a bit of an eyesore and part of the draw of World Showcase Lagoon was being able to stand there at this point right here in the center and look out and see all the different worlds. And now you have this um, big old barge and taco shells in the middle of World Showcase Lagoon. Again, I am very excited to see the new Harmonia show. I'm very excited for um, something new to come to Epcot. But at the same time, though, um, at the cost of having that ice store... Um, I, I don't know. I agree with both sides. I agree with both sides, and that's kind of the point that I'm getting at. But again, let me know your guys' thoughts and opinions down in the comments section below. If you enjoyed today's video, then please be sure to leave a like. It really helps the channel out with the YouTube algorithm. I would really appreciate a subscription. Also, if you enjoyed the video and you want to see more like this in the future, I hope you are all having a wonderful day, morning, afternoon, evening, and I will see you guys in the next video.